What's up guys, welcome to our channel, welcome to another Nene reaction and yes, this is Nene reaction, like the way I got into this world. YouTube just recommended it to me and I saw Nene in the title, I was, is this Nene? So I went, click on it and I started reading the comments and, and it seems like it's, it's Nene, there's also a bunch of Thai comments so, you know, it seems like this is Nene and what year is this Nene singing? Two years ago, so Nene in 2018. But one thing is important to notice, this is Chinese TV show. So I always thought that Chuang was the first, like she just came into China for Chuang, but seems like she was, in, she was performing and, you know, making music in China even before. This is in 2018. Oh, I, I had no idea about that, so let's go now. I don't know what this title means really, but it seems like the name of the song is... Pornapan... Pornapan... Pornpenpipat. I don't know. Help. <laughs> Yo, let's just go and see what her thinking was like in 2018. I'm getting like some 80s, 90s vibes. <laughs> Look at her! <laughs> she looks like a little baby. She looks so young here. There is no way this was only two years ago, right? It seems like she, she's like 15 here. <laughs> <laughs> He's just as excited as I am. Okay, I, I, I was just caught unprepared. What? Let me give me some more of that. This, this, this started from like some 80s, 90s vibe and now we are in some majestic, beautiful vocals. Let's continue. <laughs> to working in that time Wobu Shansho is very popular in Guangzhou my father is really addicted to this song and he was want to um, bring back this tape to Thailand when he found that um, the girl on the cover of the closet is Yang Yu Ying he is really love yeah. impact your father's life really after he back to Thailand, he wants to have a wife like Yang Ruying. <laughs> yeah, so he found. Yo, this is mom. so adorable. Yeah, but she only have a sweet face, but she cannot sing. <laughs> so after that, he uh, wished to have a daughter that can sing and also have the appearance. But yeah. we sure that your father found a.
Is that Casey? Beautiful wife. Look, look how beautiful you are. <laughs> Thank you, Shinji. Was that Casey? Wife. Look, look how beautiful you are. <laughs> Thank you, Shinji. Was that Casey tanning gun? Yo, YouTube is recommending me my reactions. So I guess they are good. Oh, two of them. Whoa. Okay, I take that as a compliment. Let me know guys if you have seen this before. I doubt, I doubt there is many people who have seen this before because this got really only 13k views. So if this is your first time watching this, what do you think? And also the most surprising thing about me is that what I said that she was performing in China two years ago. Like she got some real experience. She went into Chuang and she was already so popular, I, I had no idea. I thought she came into Chuang and the only fans she had were from Thailand. But it doesn't seem like that. So you learn every day something. And also the song was really, really nice and cute. Maybe not cute, but it was nice and peaceful and chill and the vocals were really nice. Also, I really enjoyed that part where she was talking in English. Also her English improved a lot since you could hear now she was kind of stuttering, mm, not not really knowing, like she was, her English was not as confident and as as good of a pronunciation as she got in Chuak. In those two years her English really improved. But I enjoyed hearing that story and also just joking about the appearance and singing and that. I really enjoyed this. Let me know what you guys think. I think this was this was a lot of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I really appreciate you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And have a good day.